Good morning. Let's keep it real TV. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. This is the day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. May y'all have a blessed week. Okay. Today is Monday, a fresh week. That means you got a chance for new beginnings to whatever you ain't do last week and if you woke up again today then that means you have another chance to do what you had to do and to do better okay if he woke you up this morning so that means you got another chance to do better right to reach that goal or whatever it is that you had in mind to do Get up early and do it. All right. Um, and with that being said, that's like connected to what I have to tell y'all this morning. Um, I have been thinking about um, you know, I I I was doing CNA classes um earlier last year. I think it was yeah, not what's this this year? Yeah, this year. I'm sorry. Well, yeah, and um, it's a process right now, and I finished my written my written test. Excuse me, my written test, and I have I think I guess one more test to take, and that's the skills. I however that yeah the skills test, and with that being said, um, the place where I'm trying to do my test is like it's. It's it's taking it's taking a while. They waiting for something to they waiting for um the office to open and something something I don't know what it is. I I haven't asked, but it's been months now. It's been months that I passed the first test. Um, about two months now, and I'm just waiting for that so I can finish that next process. And I've been procrastinating because it's like. I want to do it. I want to wait on them because for a certain reason, you know, and, and, uh, and one of the reasons why I don't, I do want to wait on them because if I don't wait on them, it's like the test, of course, y'all know they take you to different sites, you know, and to take the test and where they're going to see me or try to see me is going to be far off. And, and I don't like driving. Like, I mean, I, I like driving, but I don't like driving far. You feel what I'm saying? And so, and so I just, that's why I want to wait. But, and my husband keeps telling me, babe, just go ahead and do it. Just go. So you can, you know. Then you won't have to worry about a job. You know, you don't have to worry about this. And you don't have to worry about that. You will already, you will have a job. You know, the job that you want. This and the third. And that has been months now, okay? That been months. And now I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's just not sinking in. But now I just, it's like, the more you wait, the more you wait, the more you kind of forget what you study, uh, the more you for, uh, the more the more you don't wanna, you don't wanna, you know, do what you paid for or study for. You know, you you start kind of start kind of losing it. You feel what I'm saying? Like, to be honest with me, I feel like. I love the elderly. I love helping. I, I love helping, you know what I'm saying? And it's, it's like, but I'm, I feel like now, is it what I really want, though? You know what I'm saying? Now, like as in CNA. Now, this is what I'm more lingering on. I'm not going to tell you in full detail, but... <clears throat> Do I want to be a CNA? Yeah and no. Okay? I'm going to put it like this. The more I come to my client's house in different, you know, and, and just talking to elderly people, period, and listening to their conversations and how and how and what they're going through, 
it makes me want to do something else. You feel what I'm saying? But in order for me to do what I'm, you know, what I'm visioning, visualing, is that a word? I think I might have to become a CNA or at least know what CNA does. So either way, I'm going to have to pick my book back up and start studying all over again. You feel me? And either way, I'm going to go back to my book and begin studying, begin practicing, and I'm going to, uh, I'm not going to wait anymore. You know, I'm, I'm going to study, refreshing my memories of what's going on and how to do this and how to do that and remembering da, da, da. And if I have to drive far, a couple of miles, you know, to to get what I want, then I'm going to have to do it, you know? And, um, because I, first of all, I don't want the money that I put in to go to waste. And I don't want my time that I put in to go to waste. And I had a lot of people praying for me, y'all. And they probably still praying for me. So I don't want that to be like, you know what I'm saying? That's just, that's just, that's too much. So what I'm trying to tell you as I'm encouraging myself, is that one, if you put the work in to do anything, y'all, don't let and don't let people stop you or slow you down for something that you were aiming for. Just because this, these people or or whatever your situation may be, if there's if that situation slowing you down. And there's somebody else offering you offering the same thing. Go for it, go for it. It's what you want. It's if it's a passion, just go for it. You know because just you don't want to keep thinking. I could have been gone. I could have been. I could have been done this. I could have been. Uh, look, just imagine how far I would have been. You know what I'm saying? So, just anything. And it don't even have to be a career. It could be just anything. If you have a chance and opportunity to do anything good in your life, go for it. If God blessing you to wake up each and every day, go for what your dream. Go, go, go towards your dream. Go towards whatever it is. Because time waits on no one. It does not wait on no one. You know. Um, so I have a little meeting. I have a little um, meeting later on today. And I'm kind of excited because the lady, she was like, I went there like two weeks ago. And she said, <clears throat> and she, she was telling me about something. And... She said, I said, well, okay, I remember, I remember this right here. She said, I said, I've done this before. She said, yeah, I said, no, I didn't too much care for it, whatever. Then she said, well, okay, then she said, well, just come back, you know, when my boss come in. So I never went back. And then last Friday, I came back um, after my shift was over. And she said, before I could even say my name, she said, and she was like, I was hoping you would come back. I was hoping you would come back. And she said, but again, my boss is not here. So I guess every time I come, it, it, it do be kind of late. She said, my boss is not here. But please come back soon as your shift is over. And she looked me right in my eyes, y'all. She said, seriously, come right back. Come right back. So I have a good feeling that you know, um, it's gonna be, it's gonna, it's gonna go good, you know, and, and I'm praying it go good, it goes good, because I think everything else will kind of fall in place, you know, so, <sighs> I, I, I'm praying in the name of Jesus, and with that being said, y'all, 
Lord, it, I, I believe today is going to be a good day because I'm claiming it's going to be a good day. But, hun, let me tell y'all about my little situation right now before I get out this camera. Every now and then, I take some working medicine, y'all. I take some working medicine. And I don't know why I wait until the day of before I go back to work to take some working medicine. <sighs> See, and then when I took the working medicine, it was like, I like to drink coffee so it can work fast. So by the time I come to work, it'll be, you know, everything out of me just gone. You know, it's gone. Tell me why my stomach is boiling. My stomach is boiling and I'm at my client house now. Part ready, trying about to clock in. Last time this happened... I had to go do some errands for her. And while I was out, my house was like about three minutes, down, five minutes down the road. I had to go home, y'all. I couldn't do that lady like that. I couldn't, I couldn't, I can't use, I couldn't use her toilet like that. I couldn't do it. Mm -mm, nope, nope, nope. I couldn't do it. I couldn't do that. <sighs> Lord have mercy. But, um. I didn't, so I didn't pick up no coffee this morning. I wanted me some coffee so bad this morning. I said, no, I'm not going to get no cup of coffee because it's, it's going to make it worse. So, yeah, that's my situation right now. Woo! But um, I'm about to clock in, y'all. And I just wanted to encourage y'all. I just wanted to tell y'all what's going on with me. You know, I like talking to y'all. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if it be what y'all want to hear. But it's about, like, I don't really too much have, like, friends. I have a lot of cousins, but I really don't have, like, I, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. So I feel like I see why a lot of people like talking in the camera. They might, it might be the same reason why uh, I like talking to the camera. It's about like having somebody, well, I know it's y'all, but it feel like somebody like right there beside me. You know what I'm saying? Like right there. Like right there. So, yeah. Um, even though it's kind of weird when people probably like looking at you in the cars or whatever like dang she is talking like she is really talking well well but anyways um i just like talking in in the camera and i'm getting kind of used to um talking in the camera you know what i'm saying i, I kind of I, i'm getting kind of used to that you know what i'm saying you know what i'm saying but um y'all like comment subscribe and hit another <laughs> Hit the notification button so y'all know that I made a video, okay? And you turn to the left and you turn to the right and you grab your neighbor's phone and hit that subscribe button, okay? So our YouTube family could grow. Yes, I be getting so excited when I see that number pop up. Like, when it go up, I'm like, oh, somebody subscribe. And I be doing a little quick prayer for y'all, too. I be like, Lord, thank you, Jesus. Bless them, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Keep it growing, keep it growing. Yeah, every time that number pop up, like, you know, I'm like, oh, somebody subscribe, okay? I be getting so excited. You know, it, it might not be a lot to y'all, but... I be happy. I be happy, y'all. Especially with them views and stuff. I be happy. What? So, anyways, I love y'all. God bless. Um, y'all be safe out there. If it don't look right, if it don't smell right, go the other way. Don't eat it, y'all. You know what I'm saying? If the Lord said go left, go left. Don't be crazy and go to go to the go to the right. You feel me? He give you signs before time. I'm learning that myself. Okay. <sighs> All right, y'all. Be blessed.